YouTube. My name is Nina and this is my first ever video. Welcome to my empty channel. So uh, today we're talking about the Coach Pillow Tabby. Yes, I finally joined the Coach Pillow Tabby family. I watched so many reviews. I had this bag on my mind for a long time now. The reason why I'm doing this video is because if you're like me, I was debating for weeks, for weeks on which color to get. I watched so many YouTube reviews about wear and tear, about which color to get. I asked some YouTubers, which color would you recommend and so on and so forth. And in the end I decided, okay, just order it. So I ordered the black one and I ordered the ivory one. And here there are the two babies. I love them so much. They are so squishy. It is amazing. In this video, I am going to tell you which pillow tabby I decided to keep and the reasons behind my decision. Before we start with my decision, I would like to open a parenthesis on the leather of the Coach Pillow Tabby, on this fabulous, amazing, outstanding, super high quality Nappa leather. I mean, you guys, if you haven't experienced the Coach Pillow Tabby leather yet, then please go do yourself a favor and run to the next coach store and just do this or this or just pet it. I mean, it is, the leather is so soft. You can't even imagine. And the pillowy effect is just everything. It makes your day. If you're having a bad day, then just go and hug your bag. It's going to make everything better it's going to make your day like i can't get over of how outstanding the leather on this bag is so um yeah i could go on and talk about the leather forever probably <laughs> it is totally worth it it's worth every penny this bag there are bags out there that cost two thousand dollar and they don't have this type of leather Probably they're even made out of, of canvas. And I have some in my closet that cost that much and are made out of canvas. This one, I mean, for that price, what? Sorry, Coach did such a good job. It is such a nice bag. Okay, let's close this here. This is the black and this is the ivory. And yes, one is missing a tag. <laughs> so I am keeping the ivory one over the black one. And the reason behind this is that I fell in love with it, as said before, at first sight. But then I watched so many YouTube reviews where uh, people were saying that the wear and tear on this bag is pretty bad because especially with the ivory one, you will see uh, dirt, you will see pen marks and you will have to baby it a little bit more than the black one. I do agree with this point. I do agree that this bag needs some babysitting. But on the other hand side, if you're like me and usually you don't care about the bag getting dirty because especially with coach, like you can clean the leather with all their products. And in general, you already take good care of your stuff, meaning you don't wear black jeans with uh, light leather, or you, if you do, then you wear your bag up here so that it doesn't rub against your jeans. And if you're already careful with your stuff, then you could go easily with the ivory one. Another positive thing about the ivory one is that compared to the black one, the leather is less shiny. Depending on the light on the black one, you will see the scratches. When I unboxed this, it came with scratches already on the top. You can see it. And then also on the, on the bottom. And I was a little bit disappointed because I really thought that if I would get the black one, wear and tear would not be as bad. For the ivory one, the leather is not so shiny. So if it gets scratched, you won't see it that much as if you would scratch the black one. 
of course you would see here if there would be color transfer or on the edges but as for the scratches you would not see them on this one so depending on your priorities which one should you get well if you take good care of your bags and you watch out for color transfer and you do not put your bag on the floor and so on and you like the ivory one then totally go for this because it is so nice and as said you won't see the scratches as easily as on the black one meanwhile if you're just going for the black one but you initially wanted to go for the ivory one but you're going now for the black one just because of wear and tear just get the ivory one but of course if you like the black one and you don't really care about scratches then just buy it they're so nice i will keep them both but i was thinking probably i'm going to get the coach pillow tabby 18 in black would make probably more sense than having the same bag twice just like two different colors i'm really happy with my decision on keeping this and returning this so let me know what color you got and by the way i'm not talking about the colored bags because i like to keep my bags on a neutral tone so gray beige black and not go for the flashy ones but i actually also looked at the amazon green one but um maybe maybe another time <laughs> So let me know uh, your thoughts on which color to get. Let me know if you had, uh, if you also have the coach below tabby and if you think the same thing about the leather as I do. And yes, see you in my next video. Bye.